Fifty dollars on Minecraft. Oh, field network error. What? Everything all right? All right. Hmm. Going to fifty MBPS. Uh, sixty. Come on. Yeah, it goes, it goes to 60, damn. It's alright, um... But how is the download failed for a moment ago? Maybe there's a large ping spike, I don't know why does it do that. Alright, um, 11 ping, download 51 Mbps and 62 Mbps. Oh, that's actually not bad. But, there are some cases like, um, I downloaded... I, download, I downloaded some programs, but... It's not downloading as well as it used to be. How can I improve that? Yo, bro, having some Wi-Fi problems? Better check this out. I bought this in Shopee for only 250 pesos. It's a wireless adapter. Here, have it. Oh, thanks, bro. What does this do? Plug it in and see it for yourself. Okay, cool. Thanks, bro. Cringe. It's a wireless USB adapter. Let's do this. Hey guys, that skit was so hard to film. I mean, literally, I'm about to film this. War, bro, you ugly. Oh my God, you have to see this temperature. It's literally like 37 degrees. It's literally like 37 degrees right here, and I have to film without an electric fan because it's gonna make some noises okay guys i'm hella sweaty this is a very hard to film video and it's with this simple product here so straight unbox this oh my god it's so hot what am i doing what the hell am i doing oh my god ah it's so hot ah so i'm gonna unbox this wireless usb adapter so this is an ac wireless usb adapter you can read the specs here So this is a AC. What is the difference with an AC and, and wireless adapter? If you see those wireless adapter with the N in front and there's this one, AC. So an N wireless adapter is like only for 2.4 gigahertz. While this AC adapter, it goes to 2.4 gigahertz to 5 gigahertz as you can see here in the back. And that's it. Oh my god, so hot. Oh Jesus. Oh my god, what am I doing? Oh, this video is not going as well as it planned to be. Ready? Okay. So there. <laughs> Anyways, I don't want to explain this anymore. Let's just get opening. So, by the way, this is the... I don't have any N type like this. N type, like a single N type here in the front. But I do have this Xiaomi 2.4 GHz wireless adapter. We can compare that later. Just open this here and okay this is the wireless adapter get this out that's a wireless adapter and what's inside here you have a CD what the hell who uses a CD let's draw this out it's ready to one who uses a CD what the hell okay so now we're out of that way this is the AC adapter. <gasps> okay, <laughs> bro. I'm really sorry that I threw that CD out because... Bro, who uses a CD in 2021? Bro, this has a driver literally inside of it. And why do you have to put some CD? Well, at least um, if you have a Windows 7 device, I think that's very useful. But we have a USB here that has a software already. So now let's go plug it into the desktop. So I have my desktop here and it's the AC wireless adapter. So before that, let's compare it to the 2.4 GHz wireless adapter. Now it's plugged in. As you can see here, it's plugged in. Now let's go to the computer. 
This is a 2.4 gigahertz by the way. And we can just do a speed test right here. So we have a nine of we have a ping of nine. Okay, 20 Mbps for download. And I am literally sweating. Oh my god. If you can literally see me in the mirror. I am hella sweating, bros. I'm filming this in literally 37 degrees. And there's no electric fun or air con. What am I doing? Oh literally. Oh, I'm sweating. The sweat is getting into my eyes. Bro, look at this sweat. Oh my god. Okay. <laughs> Anyways. So we have a nine of we have a ping of nine, twenty point thirty five download and BPS. And nine point three upload. Okay now let's use this. Let's use this AC adapter. Remove this. Plug in the new one. And also, I also forgot. I forgot. I have a five gigahertz internet because of my PLDT provider, um, my service provider. Now you see that. Now you see that I only have a two point four gigahertz. You see, it's only two point four gigahertz Wi-Fi. It's right here. Cause I have the only, I have the two point four gigahertz plug-in right now, or the N-type wireless adapter. So you can see it's only 2.4 gigahertz. So it doesn't have the 5G on it. Cause I I for surely know that it has 5 gigahertz. Now we have to replace that with this AC wireless USB adapter. And let's see what shall it do. What it can do. And you can see there. There's a 5G connection right now. So that's the advantage of a AC USB adapter. If you have a 5 GHz wireless internet, that for surely will make your internet faster and will access the 5 GHz capability of your desktop. So when we put, hit go here, as you can see here while it's loading, we have a 10 ping and here we go oh jesus 188 megabits per second Hoo -wee! Sheesh! Sheesh! so sometimes it goes up to 200 mbps but today it's like 150 to 135 and yeah that's a wireless AC adapter. So why does it do that? So I'll explain. Okay, after the test, now time to explain what is an AC wireless adapter and an N wireless adapter. So an N wireless adapter with a single N, you can see it in many places. Like there's a logo in N, and if you see an A O two point eleven N, that is a one antenna wireless adapter. What do you mean by one wireless adapter or one wireless antenna adapter? It has a 2.4 gigahertz capability. Only 2.4 gigahertz, one antenna. While the AC, the one that I bought today, that one, the one that I showed you, has two antennas, which is a 2.4 gigahertz and a 5 gigahertz antenna. If you have a 5 gigahertz Wi-Fi, you should definitely buy this. As you can see, you can scan 5 GHz Wi-Fi network. And while the 2.4 or the N wireless adapter, it has it doesn't show 5 GHz Wi-Fi because it only is scanned to 2.4 GHz. Because 2.4 GHz or the N adapter has only one, and while the AC has two and 10 adapters, you I recommend you buying that wireless adapters. Yes, of course, you should buy a 2.4 and a 5 GHz antenna wireless adapter because it will give you faster speeds than the wireless or the N adapter. And I am sweating because it's so hot! Anyways, uh, uh, before that um, mental breakdown, <laughs> why am I recording this? In a 37 degrees, degrees Celsius room. Okay, 
chill, let's chill down for a moment. You have to buy it because if you have 5, 5 gigahertz Wi-Fi, you cannot access access that with a wireless and adapter. Yes, it's the an adapter is gonna be cheaper, but there's a lot of advantages in buying a slightly expensive or the AC wireless adapter because it is 5 gigahertz capable and 600 it can go it can go up to 600 Mbps. You can see to my test. Uh, The end adapter is only like 20 to um to 9 Mbps or from the skit it has 19 Mbps to 50 Mbps. Now I am dizzy because it's literally hot. And as you can see in the 5 gigahertz or the AC adapter, it is going up to 100 Mbps. It sounds crazy. You thought it's gonna be edited? No, boys, bros. It's not edited and it's very legit. Uh, you have to buy that because um, I paid for like 250 pesos for that wireless adapter plus shipping fee, which costs me costs me about like 300 pesos. And for you for you American fans out there or for you American people, it's gonna be four dollars or five dollars in the Amazon website. It's fairly cheap and very effective. Should you buy more expensive ones? No, you shouldn't. Buy more expensive AC adapters because because um, it's all it's it's good now for this price point. But you can <coughs> you can <laughs> you can buy more expensive um, more expensive wireless adapters if you want. There's gonna be more wireless adapters that's gonna be better than this with a higher price point. But if you have in a tight budget, you have to um, buy this um, this AC adapter that I showed you guys. Anyways, that's the end of the video. And if you guys like that, please hit the subscribe button and like the but the video. And please pray for me. Um, I'm gonna have a mental breakdown later because it's gonna be so hot. It's like 37 degrees. And yeah, guys. I think that's it. And yeah, any guys, any 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 more information should I tell you? Yeah. Lastly, is Ethernet. It's gonna be. I mean, Ethernet is gonna be better as always because it has cable connection. But yeah, if you if your Ethernet cable cannot reach the desktop, you should go for a wireless adapter. That's it. Thank you guys for watching. Peace out. And I'm, I'm gonna go away and take a bath after this.